Are you serious? Are you serious? Get ready for the beast. That's right. China <clears throat> is ready to launch an unhackable internet system. What? Well, uh, Ch Ch <clears throat> China's come up with a brand new technology. This technology it has turned to is a quantum crypto technology, a radical break from the traditional encryption methods that are being used today. The Chinese project in the city of Yan'an has been touted as a milestone by the uh, state media there in China. This pioneering project is also part of a bigger story. China is taking the lead in technology in which the West has long been hesitant to invest in. So, in the Jinan network, some 200 users from the military, the government, finance, electricity sectors will be able to send messages safely in the knowledge that only they are reading them. It is impossible to hack it. China's push in quantum communication means the country is taking huge strides, developing applications that might make the increasingly vulnerable internet more secure applications that other countries soon might find themselves buying from the Chinese. So what is this technology into which the country is pouring massive resources? Uh, well, it's an unhackable communication through quantum cryptics. Uh, if you send a message you want to keep secure from eavesdroppers, traditional encryption works by hiding the key needed to read the message in a very difficult mathematical problem. But what is difficult in terms of math? It means you have to think really fast to figure it out as you try endless combinations of long numeric keys. And in 2017, that means you need to use a very powerful computer. But uh, these steady improvements in computer power means that the number-based keys have to be lengthened periodically. Encryption has a, self, has a shelf life and is rapidly becoming more vulnerable. So there are also fears that the development of quantum computers, which effectively represent a massive step change in computer number crunching ability, <clears throat> will render much of the modern encryption software vulnerable. In other words, what we're using today will become real vulnerable once the quantum computers are in process because they can create massively fast tons of different numerical possibilities that could decode or break the code of the encryption system we're using. They're so fast. Their processors are so quick. Their mathematical calculations are so unbelievably superior than the uh, encryptions we're using that they could start just breaking into everything. So China realizes this. They're saying we have to create an internet system that is a quantum internet system. Now, what does that mean? It means everything will have to be upgraded into a whole new speed level, which means everything will have to be upgraded and um, <clears throat> that different kind of software put in. And it would also not only mean software, but it would mean uh, the hardware, the actual um, modems and, and hard drives that are being used would have to be equipped with this new uh, quantum processing. That changes the game, folks, and China's getting out ahead of it. So as we go closer and closer and closer to the m technology that will create the mark of the beast, the system itself doesn't mean you have an antichrist, but it does mean you have a system there ready for him when he takes his seat on his dark kingdom. We'll keep a close eye on what's going on. Something biblical is going on, I'll tell you that, with the signs of the second coming of Christ. Give your life to Jesus Christ and don't miss today's live broadcast. It starts at 12 noon Eastern at my website at www.publiclyprophecy.com.